2020. Win together. It's the last match of the league stage in the My 11 Circle Lanka Premier League. Nambula Viking up against Colombo Kings. Two teams uh, which have already qualified for the semi final. And they will square off today. Not surprisingly, Colombo Kings winning the toss earlier and electing to field first. Nambula Viking uh, opting for four changes in their squad. Nahiru Kumara, Anwar Ali, Paulina Taranga, Kavindu Nadishan. Four players in. And for Colombo Kings, no Siru Dana, no Andre Russell. But the newcomers, uh, Lahiru Udara, the right-handed batsman, and Himish Ramanaika. Niroshan Dikwala has a new opening partner. It's Samit Patel. Started this tournament very strong, but lately has uh, just dipped off a little bit. So maybe trying to get him a, a good run and be in prime form come the semi-finals. Gets it in the right area. Sweetly timed. Just caressed it all along the ground. It was swinging away. But his hand so good. A my 11 champion shot. Gets this one through as well. A little too wide. And it goes for four. Slow delivery it was. Races across the ground. It's a fast outfield. And it beats the field, gets into the gap. It goes for four. Some innovation. Gets it over that fielder in the short fine leg position and gets four. My 11 circle champion shot. Slow delivery. Too full, too straight. Easy pickings for Dikwella. It's working on his balance. The balance is working well. Not for the Colombo Kings. Good. Oh, he's chipped that. Chipped that for six. Samit Patel. Oh, yes, boy. There we go. You said it, Mikiata. He strikes. Gets the breakthrough for this uh, Colombo Kings team. Yeah, he's the go-to man. It was the ball that spun before that, is, that has got Sami Patel thinking he had to sweep. He's just dragged it on. Well ball, Case Ahmed. He's done the job for Angelo Matthews. But this is massive, though, because it's in the power play. And you see spinners come in and fire it in. He's bowled it slow. He's tossed it up. Samit Patel for 26, 50 for 1. Ah! Loud appeal, loud appeal, and given. Again, he's on the money. Case Ahmed, first delivery. Upal Taranga couldn't negotiate it. Will he take the review? He goes for it. Suddenly the game has changed. 50 for no loss. And now, 50 for two. How often do we say, add a couple of wickets to the score and it's a big difference to the game. He's got wet for nothing. Upul Taranga, 50 for two. Gotcha. Over the top of the bowler. Value for runs down there. Straight back over the top for four. That is clever. That is outstanding. It's also four runs early in the over. Down the track. He said that nicely. One bounce, gone for four. That's the second boundary in this over. Short delivery. And he's put that way absolutely superbly. That is a wonderful strike. It's flat. He's clubbed that away as well. That's another short delivery. 
That is a my 11 champion shot. He's got the length thrown completely, Tixila de Silva. Dequella. He's getting it to go through, not through the field, but through the air. Oh, good running, good running. Back for two, they make it seven off that. Gets him to 50, his second in the tournament, Narushan Dequella. Tugged away through the onside, we saw some outswing from him early on. Dequella goes through the offside again. That's been his favorite area in this innings. And he adds some more, add four. Direction was good. Even if he mishit it, he was safe. Didn't run the risk of losing his wicket and it goes all the way for a six. Reverse sweep in front of extra cover. <laughs> wow. Now that's gone over the top. No, it hasn't. That's out. So Matthew's back into the attack. He has picked up a wicket. There's no celebrations there. Very, very good innings by Nirushan Dikwela today. This has been a very good partnership. Angela Matthews, pace of the ball, rolls his fingers across it. Dikwela trying to hit it over the leg side. Top edges it. And very well taken by Dushman Chimera. Dikwela out for 65 or 40, 144 for three. Oh, that's a great connection. That really is. That's gone for six runs. I needed that, I guess. Beautiful connection. Good connection. Yep, that's over the top, and that's a great way to start the over. Down the ground. It might go. It is going to go. That's four runs. That is superbly played. Full into the pad, but it's beaten the man down there. Thin edge. Four. Slower ball. Oh, no. Just made a mess, mess of things in the, on the boundary at mid-wicket. Next ball goes for four. hammered away that's backward and that's gone for 4-2 just a little bit of a knock-on and that's really clever as well and it's one bounce and it's gone for four what do we got just one shy of 20 off that over 19 gone 193 for three hard down the ground just one. Oh no! Plus three. It's nicely bowled. It's a good delivery to finish. You can't do too much with that. I don't think there was a lot wrong with that over, really. In the end, 10 runs from it though. 20 overs gone. 203 for three it is. Angelo Pereira, it was terrific. It really was. Dan Viking, really good opening stand. Sami Patel, 26 of 13. And Nirushan Dikwela, 65 of 40. Got the innings going. Angela Pereira was superb. 74 of 51. And Dasan Shanaika does what he does best. He finished 28 of 15. Very good score, 203 for three. Well, the bowling, well, they struggled a lot. Look at Matthews at the top, just two overs, going at five runs. Priyanjan was good under 10. And of course, Ahmed, excellent again under six runs but every other bowler struggling particularly uh, uh Dushmanta Chamira going for a few runs Tikshila 
So it's not been an impressive bowling effort by the Colombo Kings, and I don't think their fielding helped them either. Okay, that's the uh, situation as we stand at the moment. 204 runs is required. The target is 10.2 uh, runs per over. The weather seems okay. The outfield's going to be a little bit damp, but it is going to be fascinating to watch this. It is game number 20. It's all about who finishes a number one spot in the league stage. The team that wins here will be on the top, and they'll obviously prefer to play the fourth team, though all gladiators have been really difficult to predict they've been giant killers if that's the right word that's a good stroke use of the feet gets to the pitch and hits it all the way for a six should be out should be out yes it is we were asking why Anwar Ali wasn't brought on earlier. This is why. Immediate success. And this is what pressure does. This is what scoreboard pressure does. Because the Colombo Kings needed to move quickly. And Chandimal looking to hit it on the up. And, uh, well, Samit Patel at mid-off. Holding on to an important catch. And Anwar Ali immediately striking off the second ball. Chandimal goes for three, it's 20 for one. Crisply time. That was real aggression. Use of the feet, how often have we seen this? That's glorious from Laurie Evans. There he goes again, this time through the onside. And again, taking a hammering. Oh, drum it into the act. Big over for Colombo Kings. Oh, that's away. That's a boundary off the first ball, the over. That hurts. Young leg spin and up, in addition. That's oh, gone bravo, away, bravo. and that's gone for four. Bravo. Now that is over the top for six. Not by much, though. There was a man back. Oh, he's nailed that. That is right out of the screws. That is a big, big six. Didn't bounce too much, and he's picked it up perfectly. 108 yesterday. Of 65, and look at where he is today. 53 of 24. Laurie Evans, slow start. Oh dear, he's had a big lunch, has he? Well, he got hit in the last over, I think. He got a nasty blow in the last over. Maybe he's uh, perhaps done something to his stomach here. Let's see if he just grimaces there. Yeah, maybe he's just pulled a stomach muscle. He's off. He can't continue. So this is uh, a Christmas. lot worse than what we uh, thought it was, I guess. So he's going to have to retire hurt. So that's not great news at all for the Colombo Kings. Oh, that's probably out. It is out. So straight away, Samuel Patel, who got tapped all over the place by Laurie Evans, has taken a gap. He's back into the attack. Has he hit it? If he hit it, he knows. He should have known as a batsman that he's hit it. I reckon he has. He should have got take. Oh, no. On debut, he's made a massive mistake. Gone for one. 73 for two, the Colombo Kings. Oh, mama. <laughs> Nick. There's a Nick. That's out. Wickets are tumbling now. Laurie Evans retired for 53. So unlike yesterday, he was the one scoring all the runs. 60-70% of them he's gone. The others want to follow him. Ideally follow in his footstep of hitting the ball. Gone for 14. Colombo Kings 79 for 3. That might 
might be out. Oh, it's in the hands, I think. Should worry down there. Good chin, good chin. And just popped out. Swung away behind Squalic for four. That's a welcome boundary. Punched. That's a boundary. The minute you play the ball in the gap, goes all the way. As we just show in that shot, it's a My 11 champion shot. That's a fine tickle, fine leg inside the circle. That's badly directed. That's poor bowling by Anvarali. Four. No, oh, what broad balls are we talking about? It's six. This is high and should be taken. Down to the man at deep cover. And eventually turned out to be a fairly straightforward catch. Nasun Shanika going for that full length delivery. Tixila de Silva quite deep in the crease. Skying to the man at deep extra cover. Split a useful hand. 31 from 16. 128 for four. Polina, Polina Taranga just dropping short. Short pitch delivery, too short. Five overs to go now. That's a beautiful start to the last five overs. Hard down the ground. Oh, that's scooting away off this wet turf. Oh, it's clubbed. It's clubbed for six. What a magnificent shot that is. That is outstanding. Oh, he's clubbed it. He's clubbed it. He's clubbed it a long, long way. He had just picked that up beautifully. That's high. Has it gone on the way? Yes, it has. That's six. That is an outstanding way to start the over. He's on the case. Case is on the case. Again. Oh, that's even better. That's gone miles again. He is having a time of his life out there. Maybe his partner's having even more fun. Let's try it again. Has it gone all the way? Yes, it has. That's another one. That's three in a row. Bang, bang, bang. And this game is basically over. He just wants to finish it now. Three sixes in a row. There it is. It's all over. It is all over. That is the fourth six in that over. That is just absolutely magnificent stuff from Case Ahmed. He's gone to 50 as well off 22 balls. Six, five sixes it is, and two fours. Wow. Just absolutely extraordinary. As we look back at the match summary as well, Dumbulla Viking batting first, 203 for three in their 20 overs. Pereira, Angelo Pereira, I thought did a really good job with that 74 not out. Dick Weller played nicely for 65 off 40 balls. Shainika, the captain, 28. Two for 23 for uh, Case Ahmed, two quick ones as well. And Colombo Kings, what a sensational performance. They won with seven balls to spare, 205 for four it was. Evans 53, Ahmed 50 not out of 22 deliveries, Preanjan 47 not out of 28 deliveries, and wickets were shared. They won by six wickets, the Colombo Kings. Right, let's have a look at the updated points table now. There's a confirmation of what I was talking about. The Colombo Kings are at the top. They've got 12 points. Viking 11, Jaffna Stallions third with nine. And the Gold Gladiators with uh, four points at number four. So it is going to be one versus four and then two versus three. That's how uh, it works.